Hello everybody. So today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is about application of derivative. So now I will show you how to answer. We want to find the minimum value of the average cost for the given cost function on the given intervals. So now I will show you how to answer. We have A and B. They are two intervals in here. Now, this is about the total cost, but the question does is about the average cost. To do about the average cost, we put about CS over S. And this one, I will put about f of s. So we have cs that is about this one. And now we have this one divided by s. So we have s squared plus 32 plus 432 over S. Now, we need to do first derivative of the function. First derivative of S square, we have 2S. This one, that is about the constant. So you got about zero in here. First derivative of this one, we have negative 432 over s square and now I will put this one equals to number 0 that means we have 2s minus 432 over s square equals to number 0 so I will put this one go to the right So, I will put S square go to the left and number 2 go to the right. And this one we have 216. We put the cubic root for the both sides in here. And we have s equals to number 6. And now we need to draw variation table. So because we have two intervals in here, so we start from 1 to 10 and from 10 to number 20. So when s equals to number 6, this one equals to number 0. Now we need to find the side of first derivative of the function in here. To do about this one, I will select about the number between form, num form number number 1 and number number 6. So I will choose about number 3 in here. So I will put about number 3 going here. And we can find the side of this one. So if I put number 3 going here, so I will put number 3 going here and here. We got about negative 42 in here so the side of from number one to number six that's about negative now i will select number seven between number six and number ten so i will put number seven cone here to find the side of first the derivative of the function and we have positive 5.1 so that means the side of this one is about positive. 
and now this side should be about positive in here because we just have only one solution there is no more so solution in here so the side of this one they keep the same because we have the formula in here if first the refer to is negative so that means the function f of s decreasing if first the derivative of the function is positive that means the function is increasing now we apply the formula in here and we just put the side from here to here here to here and here now about s equal to number 6 i will put number 6 gone here to find the value of this one in here so that should be about this one now i will put number 6 gone here and here to find the value of this one that is about 144 now I will put about s equal to number 10 gone here and here so we have 175.2 and the last one that's about number 20 we put number 20 gone here and here so we have 400 53.6 and now on the interval from number 1 to number 10 the minimum that's about 140 when s equals to number 6 about the interval from number 10 number to number 20 175.2 is smaller than this one in here so the average minimum of this interval in here that should be about 175.2 when s equals to number 10 and this is the answer question a and question b this is the end thank you for watching